I'm always interested in titles, books. You know, they give so much away. And before you leave, full of ambiguity, and you're leaving home, or maybe you're leaving the, the nest and care of your family. And maybe you're even leaving university and training and heading off into the world. And you know, then the ultimate question is, where are you going to go when you die? Uh, we lost our oldest son. And out of that, I took a year to think it over very carefully. And one of the takeaways from all of that is that it is so easy to get distracted. It's so easy to be sort of taken on into various rabbit holes where you're fixing this or that problem in the world or you're, or you're just trying to survive. But sooner or later, if you don't face the ultimate questions uh, of death and what it is to meet God, then I think there's something lacking. You've got a, a massive hole in your thinking about existence and life as a whole. And, and death brings us up short. One of the things actually that has always captured me in my own journey is A, not just the reality of evil. Uh, many people, evil drove them away from God. In my case, it was quite the opposite. But one of the things that I found intoxicating about the Christian faith is that at the heart of it is in fact the death of someone who's loved us more than we ever love ourselves. And we can then deal with the challenge of death and life beyond the grave because we can do it in the presence of a risen Lord who's been through all that. And one of the things that I love about this book is that Todd has found a way to introduce that that's uh, clear and crisp and that's honest and authentic. And that, that's not easy.